Lawrence is the TK Force, the team killing force of nature himself. We are back with another installment of Let's Play Minecraft Adventure Map Edition. The Sea of Flame 2. I always feel like I'm getting that wrong. It's such a freaking mouthful. But at any rate, I am joined once again by Foodzilla, the lizard creature from another planet that I met in preschool. And, uh, let's see here. We, uh, want to show you a couple of things here. Those bookcases. Actually talk so they know you're alive and not mute. <laughs> Might be a good idea. Alright. I could say a few words here and there. Fair enough. Uh, those bookshelves we found at the end of the last set, I brought them in here. I put them up around our enchanting table, because I thought that could be handy. And I also uh, moved our brewing stand so it wasn't in the way. And so yeah, that's, that's a nice little addition to our base. Of course, the brewing stand's still useless until we find water, but who knows. I also went and ground zombies a little bit. Uh, originally, it was going to be for food, but that problem was taken care of when Foodzilla found a skeleton spawner near the tree that we... the very first tree on the map, I think it was. I, I think so. I think it was just but below that. Just up on that mountain. Anyway, so we've got a little grind spot there for skeletons now, which uh, gets us uh, bone meal for uh, lots of mushroom stew. We will quite possibly waste a lot of mushroom stew just because it's the most you know, readily available food source for us. So if we're down by two... Uh, Food points, I believe, is the actual technical term. We might eat mushroom stew, even though it recovers, like, four or whatever. I went and I ground skeletons for, like, two freaking hours or something, just to make sure we would have all the bone meal we need. Plus... I got some nifty levels out of it. Gave some of our stuff some enchantments. I've got some... Uh, protection 2 pants on, uh, power bow 1, uh, and that's actually my weaker bow. It was dropped by one of the skeletons. Then I was like, they drop enchanted bows? That's cool. Thank you. Yeah, then I got, uh, then I give my iron sword here, knock back and fire aspect. When I was ground grinding for the zombie flesh too, they dropped another iron sword, which was awesome because, uh, I think think that Food E lost his iron sword when he was trying to reset <laughs> yeah. yeah he was trying to reset the nether for our map because he he felt it was the wrong nether it was yeah. not the vex nether um basically we're this server is running on the multiverse plugin and one of the things is that map the way maps are allocated isn't the typical way they're supposed to be, and so for whatever reason, our, the nether that Vex created wasn't linking up with the nether that we had, and it took me a while, including one um, instant where I teleported underground into solid rock <laughs> to um, use the portals plugin to make the nether portal actually go to the nether for this map. Though, yes. Yeah, those keeping track with a death counter at home, <laughs> do not count that. That's not a fair death. I that lost was my iron sword and all my equipment. <laughs> and and we're not even using our mod powers to bring that stuff back. Oh. We're <laughs> Yeah, we're we're playing totally totally legit here. So that that's cool. very cool of us. And it's it would actually be fair for us to bring that stuff back, considering it was just some glitchy server thing that took them away. But I couldn't even remember. The only thing I remembered that I lost was the hand sword, and everything else was just like, yeah. okay. And your leather armor. That's kind of a yeah. Blow. But I think we've got some leather armor left here. 
there, there's a there's a pair of pants or two left at least. Here I've got four levels actually um, on me from. I tried to see if I could grind another because one of the things they dropped was an iron ingot while I was grinding them too. So I tried to see if I could get another, but it just didn't seem like a worthwhile use of time. So here, let me see if I can enchant some pants for you. <laughs> oh, good pants! Here we go. Pants. Protection one pants. It's something. Yay. There you go. My pants will be the pinkest. Yeah. I actually I put most of my levels into a really cool bow. The from all that skeleton grinding, but I'm not taking that with me until, you know, I know an area is a little bit safer, because that'd be a shame to lose. That's the reason I'm not taking the cool diamond sword that no, uh, oh. Vex uh, gave us, either. I, I think I remember, I don't know if it was in the last video, but one of us actually died because of this door. <laughs> and the door has a, has a confirmed kill. Ah. Remember? Oh yeah, it can do a little bit of suffocation damage. I think I took a half heart on the other doors in that uh, vault of relics. Oh, that was it. So, of in the last episode. Of course, I was full health, full food, so it didn't really matter. Those doors, I think, killed somebody. I think you were on half a heart because you were starving? Yes, probably. I think that was off camera, though. Didn't bother counting that either because I don't know. Maybe I should have, but whatever. Yep. Uh, so we are all set up. I think the first thing I want to see if we can do is head back over to that. Here's the mushrooms where we've been growing them. Uh, we'll show you the skeleton grinder later. Um, I want to head back over to this area where the ghasts have decided they will never despawn. Alright. And oh. I believe the area we got the wool from here was... This is very spur of the moment, by the way, people. If, <laughs> if we're a little off our game or something, because... Uh, Foodie was just like, hey, maybe we should do it uh, tonight rather than tomorrow. And I'm like, oh, maybe. Uh, should I switch computers? You sure? And he's like, oh, maybe. What do you feel like? And I'm like, uh, I'll switch computers and we'll just, we'll see. The, I can see the sun. Yeah, that chunk hasn't loaded. I can see the sun. It's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. Anyway, I said, I'll just, I'll just, uh, I'll just switch computers and we'll see where the night takes us. We'll have a few drinks and we'll see where the night takes us. You know. <laughs> Man, I am very scared about the non-loadingness of this all. And where are you? I'm, I'm on the... I'm not going in that room. Are you crazy? <laughs> see a right. zombie. Yeah, I can't... I can't see anything. This is... This is messed up. Oh, there, are, there were even torches there, and I still couldn't see what was going on. Where are you? I can't see you at all. I went over to that area with the stairs. Oh, I see. I'm up on the railway. Oh, no. Oh. I, I explained my theory before recording. Kind of. Maybe it was after the last set and you've forgotten. Anyway, my theory here is that over here by these stairs, if I remember correctly, we find a sign on this pillar here that says Dungeon 4, Hall of Flame South. And over here we've got Dungeon 3, Hall of Flames North. So we might as well just finish off this little area here and get both the wolves real quick, you know. All right. So we don't have to come back here again through the ghasts, which I did not see, by the way, but then again I saw the sun, so who knows? I can hear them. Yeah, it's I'm, I'm the... hearing them a little now, but... Whoa, okay! <laughs> nearly nearly hit you. Nearly nearly did it. Okay, how often is that going to happen? I have no idea. What have we got going on here? 
Oh. That, that was my emergency. Oh my goodness. Why are these zombies... Why do these zombies keep on coming? Kind okay. Of wall of just like, stop. Okay. Taking a little pee. Oh, zombies. Nice. Yeah, pretty much. Okay, can we uh, can we find out where they're coming from then and try and put a stop to it? Uh, that would be thinking. cool. Throwing down a chest, tossing. Block some off stuff this in. dark room here. All right, I'm coming. Oh my goodness, you are really not here. Okay, I was block off down that. A chest yes, that I think they're coming from that room there. Oh shit, they are not. They are not. Repeat, they are not coming from that dark room. Creeper. Creeper. Run. Run. Creepers. Lots of creepers. Okay, lots of creepers. Mission run is enacted. Where are you? I, I ran back, dude. I told Where you to I? run. I saw a zombie pop right out of the floor around here. Whoa, are you kidding me? No, I'm not okay. kidding. So, I'm kind of thinking... It to tear apart the floor for no reason, apparently. Yeah, maybe it was just uh, too dark. I know he... Likes yeah, they're not supposed stuff. to spawn right in your field of vision, though, are they? No, oh, that is true. Okay, block off that room there. I light it up. There's nothing in there. Okay. Okay, fine. It's fine, guys. We're oh, not... there is a chest in here. Sandstone. Sand. Oh, grab. grab. Gra oh, leave. Leave, leave, leave. Forget it. We'll get it on the way back if we survive. It's just another one of those railway chests with all the... But it's got sandstone and sand. We need blocks desperately. Yes, we do. How did we get in this situation? Well, yeah, I kind of used all the cobble and the victory monument. That's why. Okay, I see a checkered floor here that's made oh. me very interested in plugging it. Uh, it sounds completely reasonable. Um, You're lighting them on fire. Whoa. Yes. I, my, my iron sword is a baby version of the diamond one that Vex gave. Okay, back up, back up. Too many, too many. Lag. No, 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 wait, not too many come to think of it. We've just got to get there and plug that hole somehow. Here, let me... Oh, shit. I'm trying to help you, but I don't have okay. a lot of left, so... Okay, back up, back up, back up the stairs. Okay, we got it. Sort of. Oh, I'm on fire. You don't me? be on fire! You That's your me. only job right now, is to not be on fire. Okay, backing up the stairs. We are at. We are doing that thing that I mentioned with the whole getting out of here. And going to. Uh, let's try a different strategy, shall we? I'm gonna let my heart heal. <laughs> Just a little. Oh, s s uh, spider eyes. I want to mention, guys, that little survival tip I gave you last time. How you can eat spider eyes. They have a good chance of poisoning you. So. You know, use that sparingly. There's obviously some sort of spawner issue going on down there. Yes. Get away from it for a minute. I think it's the probably against... Well, they're, they're probably set so if you're on the stairs of any... at all at all. Yes, I said at all at all. At all at all. If you're on the stairs any, in any way, you're probably too close. At all, at all. There's something. I'm picking up blocks. You know what? We need blocks. We could use some blocks. I'm gonna try and get a different vantage point. I'm just gonna take. Ah, oh, clever 